Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody, Philadelphia Flyers fans and Phantoms fans. This is going to be a joint ghostly take and the grittiest take as Morgan Frost should be called up for the Philadelphia Flyers at this juncture due to the fact that Dirk Broussard went down. If he's banged up for tonight's game, he should already be on a plane, and that should be announced within the coming hours that he is getting called up, if not by the end of this video, honestly, just due to the fact of necessity at that point. But also, I'm redoing this video today. Please subscribe if you enjoyed the content down below on the subscribe button. Appreciate the 158 of you so greatly that have subscribed this far. But I misread some stats yesterday, so let's get into it. He, in 16 games, has 15 points with 3 goals and 12 assists. Is playing a much better 200-foot game, well-rounded game. He's a points-per-game type guy. Still on the offense, but playing on the PK as well as the power play. That's why he started in the minors, as well as only being able to play two tilts last season due to injury. So he lost a whole season of development due to injury, just like, unfortunately, Tyson Forster, who I just did a video on that I'm going to link at the end of this video, as well as the video on the two veteran additions we made yesterday that I'll link at the end of this video. But Morgan Frost... He's ready. He's showing that he's committed to being the guy you want him to be and to be able to well round his game and round out his game. Is there still flaws? Yeah, JJ pointed them out on the post game broadcast for whoever had the um, stamina after that pitiful game last night to watch the post game, but he pointed it out. He still makes some of those mistakes that you don't want to see, but he has great hands and he's starting to use those hands more effectively than ever in the defensive zone compared to how we've already seen mightily at times with the Lehigh Valley Phantoms, and of course on his first goal in the NHL against former Flyer Bobrovsky, his great hands on the offense. He's now starting to use them on the defensive side, forcing turnovers, using his speed to cut off passing lanes, and also not jumping the gun. Morgan Frost is a guy that used to sometimes kind of jump the gun a little bit, and that's what would hurt him where he would try to jump the play offensively, and that would hurt him defensively. He's not doing that anymore. He's playing a much more disciplined game, a much more well-rounded 200-foot game, and that is why it is time for the call. He's a points-per-game guy, a 200-foot player, and a guy that has speed, good hands. What the hell are you waiting for at this point, particularly also if Derek Broussard is out for an extended period of time? I feel like we're going to hear about this in the very near future, but this has been a redo of the Morgan Frost video and how he should get caught up since I accidentally misread stats. Apologize for that yesterday, so this video is going up again today. Have a great day, pleasant day, everybody. This has been the Sports Fan News. Morgan Frost should get caught up video. Peace out, everybody, and continue you to have great success, Morgan.